Harry in Agony. King Charles bans Harry from attending the 2027 Invictus Games in the UK. Prince Harry faces anguish as King Charles prohibits his attendance at the 2027 Invictus Games in the UK, marking a shocking twist. The highly anticipated return of the Games, coinciding with the first UK event since Harry and Meghan's departure, has stirred uproar with the Prince's exclusion. This unexpected ban has reverberated through the royal family, sparking a media storm and prompting questions about Harry's future involvement in the cherished charity and his strained relationship with his father. The Invictus Games, a symbol of Harry's dedication, serves as an international sporting event for wounded armed service personnel and veterans, profoundly impacting the Prince's philanthropic journey. Speculation about strained family ties between Harry and King Charles has heightened since the Sussex's departure, with palace insiders hinting at ongoing tensions. The band strikes a blow to Harry's philanthropic efforts and his mission to unite people through sport, deeply affecting his relationship with the Invictus Games, which he founded in 2014. Inspired by his own military service, Prince Harry understands the transformative power of sports on mental and physical well-being. Through the Invictus Games, he has provided a platform for wounded veterans to showcase their resilience, fostering a global community of support. With Harry's absence from the 2027 Invictus Games, concerns arise about the continuity of his charitable legacy and his future involvement. Public reaction has been one of sympathy and disappointment, with many lamenting the missed opportunity to showcase the strength of Harry's commitment to veterans. As Prince Harry grapples with this latest challenge, the world awaits his response and his determination to empower wounded veterans through the power of sport. The decision by King Charles has not only deepened rifts within the royal family, but also raised questions about Harry's ongoing charitable endeavors. It remains to be seen how the Duke of Sussex will navigate this setback and continue his mission of empowerment.